So this is part two about drawing inequalities and make sure you've seen the first part uh, where I explained to you that it's actually the same as uh, drawing an equality in equation uh, except when you actually are drawing the line you just have to slow down a minute and uh, think. Yeah? So check my site explainingmaps.com to find all those resources nicely organized for you. So I'm just going to copy the inequalities here um, so I can make a table of values because I need to find two coordinates to draw a line. I always do three to check myself. So 2x minus 2 and minus half x plus 2. All right, there we go. So I'm going to make a table of values. I'm going to do it relatively quickly, guys. Um, choose three values for x. Let's say is 0 when x is 0 minus 2. Let's take 1 for x, 2 times 1 is 2, minus 2 is 0. And let's take for x is 2, 2 times 2 is 4, minus 2 is 2. Okay, so indeed I'm doing it relatively quickly. I'm going to do the second inequality as well. I'll take 0, the y-intercept is 2. Now because it's a fraction and the denominator is 2, I'm going to take multiples of 2, yeah? because then I don't get any fractions in my, um, in my y value, yeah? because we don't like fractions, do we? So I'll take 2 and 4. So when x is 2, minus a half times 2 is minus 1, uh, plus 2 is 1, and 4 times minus a half minus 2, plus 2 is 0. Good. Now I can check when I'm drawing the line if I made any silly mistakes there. That's why we do three points. So the first one, I'm going to plot the points 0, minus 2. Let me just take that away. 0, minus 2. Uh, that's going to be here. That's the y-intercept. Then 1, 0. So as you can see, so far it is as if you are drawing a linear equation. 2, 2. It's nothing different. There we go. Are they on one line? Yes, they are. I didn't make a mistake. But when you draw the line, you just got to slow down. Because it's an inequality and it's only bigger than 2x minus 2 and not bigger or equal, only bigger, or when it says only smaller, so not equal, then I have to draw a dotted line to show that all the points on the line are not part of the solution. All right, and let me label that y equals, no, not y equals, uh, y is bigger than 2x minus 2. All right, now, the question will then say shade the area you're interested in or, or shade the area you're not, not interested in. Yeah, but that's more a linear programming question. So check my questions about or my videos about linear programming to see which part to shade them. All right. The second one, zero, two. Uh, should I do that in green? Yeah, let's do that in green. Zero, two. That's the y-intercept, two. Uh, negative gradient, so it's going down to 1, to 1, yes indeed, 4, 0, 4, 0. Are they on one line? Yes, they are. Now just slow down because it's an inequality, smaller or equal. So that means I can just draw a line as I've been doing already for years because it's also equal. So that's it. And I'll label it beautifully with the inequality, smaller or equal to minus a half x plus two. You see that? Beautiful. Like and share this if it was useful. Check my site explainingmaps.com. You'll find all the resources you need and nicely organized and for free of course. You can ask me questions there. You can find me on Facebook, Twitter and ask me your questions there too. And for the rest what I have to say is I wish you a very pleasant day. Bye bye.